Hey, what's going on everyone? Don here and you're watching VR Gamer Dude and well today we're going to be jumping back into some more VR horror. That's right. So we're going to be checking out the Exorcist Legion VR here in the MetaQuest 2. And, you know, I, the reason being is, is they've just done a major update to the game. Better graphics, 90 hertz support, better 3D audio. So I can't wait to see what Fun Train has done with this. Let's go. Alright, so here we are in the game, and I've got to say, automatically, I can already tell that the graphics have been overhauled. Last time I played this, uh, it looked kind of washed out, and everything is just looking more colorful and solid, and man, I'm digging this already. So, alright, uh, last time I played, I did play uh, Chapter 1, but it has been so long, I think I am going to go ahead and revisit it, uh, because I would be completely lost going into Chapter 2, so... Let's give this another shot. Homicide, come in, this is dispatch. Oh, uh, hold on. Homicide. Hey, there's a call for you guys down at Church of St. Vincent de Paul. Uniforms are already on scene. This is a weird one. Oh, that's just the way I like them. Spooky dark in this church. All right, so here we go. We're going to follow the clues here. So first clue, what do we got here? It looks like an empty box. Some sort of a kit here. There we go. Close that up. All right. So on to clue number two here. What do we got? Send him into the swine. Uh, was that door moving? Oh, it is moving just slightly. What the heck? Uh, I don't want to open it. <laughs> oh God, how disgusting. Okay, so we got a dead priest and a, and a freaking pig's head here. Oh, you can swivel it. Can I take it off? No. What do you got in your hand, buddy? Oh, hey! Oh, and the cockroach crawling out into your eye. That was just disgusting. Oh, oh, oh that looks like one of the things in here. There we go. Got my salt spray. All right, so let's look around this church. What do we got here? I got the Holy Bible here. Power of Christ compels you! So, all right. Ooh, freaky. Okay. Exorcism rights. Okay. This is reminding me of Dread Halls. Okay, find out what happened in the church. Where is the priest? Um, well, I thought I found the priest dead in the confessional there, but, you know, I, I guess not. Maybe we should uh, move on here. Oh. Oh, okay. This must be his office. Oh, hey. Hold on. How do I get it back open? There we go. holy water okay so it looks like I'm trying to prepare a kit here so, let's see. all 
The Mississippian sacred statue said to have been taken by a Spanish explorer in the 1500s. Hidden in an elaborate maritime ornament, it is thought that the statue was ground down to create a powder used to ward off the evils such as treacherous journeys. Unfortunately for the explorer, the real evil came from his fellow man. On his return to Spain, the Spanish Inquisition soon got word of his love affair with a native woman and tried him as a heretic. So, okay, I have no idea what that's all about, but let me see. Oh, oh, got some notes on an exorcism here. So, gift opens this way and ushers the presence in a grate. If found, please return to Father Bell Church of St. Vincent. Okay, so this just looks like... Okay, here we go. So, I guess for the purposes of the video, I'm not going to really read through all this stuff. If you guys want to play it, you can definitely do that. Um, but, you know, definitely adds to the story of what's going on here a little bit. Yeah, how can they? With my own eyes, first the West Bank, then Eritrea, now a young girl in Morocco. There's only one kind of thing that feeds off such misery, and is gaining strength. If I sweep war and drop the pixels from the region, they say something has to be done, but Rome treats me as a man. I was a fool to believe that I could continue for the Man, I will say the 3D audio in here is much better than it was before. The, the rain sound and the clock, and I can definitely hear that I the, the farther away I go from the uh, from the uh, tape recorder here. So very cool. What is this? Seven. Got some blood here. Oh. Aha! Man, that's freaky. This whole game is freaky. Ah. There's my cross. There we go. Pretty sure that's one of the uh, achievements. I always love it when you find tapes in a game and you kind of have to listen to them as you're kind of going around the room. My guide stepped foot in his home. And though we tried to convince him otherwise, we eventually drove to abide. Ah! God, that was loud. We sat below her window. Just above our heads, we could hear her strained cries through the night. The hours drew on. We tried to reason with her father again, but he was as stubborn as I persisted. We all raised our voices. She must have heard us as we argued in the street below. Because she let out a scream with such ferocity. And I thought a pack of wild dogs must be in her room. We raced upstairs. I was right behind her father as he flung open the door. The sight inside was like nothing I have seen before. A broken young girl. A body twisted and fractured, devoid of life. Innocent. So Okay, well, we'll skip that third tape once again just for the purposes of keeping the video a little shorter here. But uh, definitely, if you're playing this, go through all of it. That's just adding to the creepy factor of it, hearing these exorcism stories and stuff. Okay. So now we're back out here. Too bad I can't play this pipe organ. That would be cool. Whoa, what the? What? Hey, oh my god! Oh, talk about dread halls. Okay, got moving statues. See, it's been so long since I played this, I totally forgot everything. Oh, man, these whispers are really getting me. What? God dang it. Why am I doing this? Why am I playing horror? I hate VR horror. Because now eh, most, most of the time it's just cheap jump scares like that. But, oh, man, it's really getting me. Okay, so now you're trying to block my way. 
What's going on here? I'm gonna hide in here. Can I? You have nightmares, don't you? Just well, I am gonna have nightmares now. Especially since you turned off my headlamp. Now I can't see. Oh, sweet. Swine, what? Oh! There's a pig man! What the shit? I know that you've been working hard, but I've tried so Oh, this is so wrong. And it's been a decade or more since my last parents. Please, sir. May I ask you a question? Why does your god swim in such filth? Man, the audio in here is tripping me out. Oh, please don't get up, father. Oh, she, what the, hey, you're throwing chairs at me. Okay, you're prone to flashing lights. Yeah, if you're prone to like flashy lights and scary audio, I don't recommend Oh god, oh, hey, where's my kid? Hey. Hell no. Yeah, um, I think I'm about to get eaten by a demon. What the shit? Okay. A dead exorcist, me out cold, and the thing in the shadows. How the hell do I write this case up? Exactly. This is freaking nuts. You know, I think we're going to save that for another time because uh, there's definitely got uh, four more chapters to go here in the game. But, you know, I don't want to keep these videos long. I, I do like to make them kind of, you know, 10, 12 minutes. Uh, so I think we will leave those for another time or I'll leave those for you guys to play. But for me, that's going to do it today, guys. My, my heart can't take it anymore. This is already, chapter one already got me jump scared to all get out. But if you want to play this game, I highly recommend that you check it out if you have a quest too and you're looking for something scary i'm gonna throw links for it in the description so go and grab a copy but as i said for me i'm out i'll see you guys in the next one this is don signing off